We heard this huge uh, loud banging on our door and like our wall. That's when Olin Zach says she got up and woke her husband. And so I shook him and woke him up and he had put earplugs in for the firework. So he didn't even hear the door and he was like, what? From there, Olin Zach says she ran to the back door and heard her neighbor yelling that her house was on fire. When she turned and looked out the door, her deck and the stairs completely on fire. Yelling for her daughter and husband to get out, she then grabbed her Shih Tzus and six puppies. And and I started to run with them outside, but I tripped. And so I broke my fall and I started throwing the puppies out onto the patio. And my husband was already off the deck. So he was grabbing the puppies and throwing them off. And in a matter of minutes. And then there was like a seven foot flame and I see my last two puppies catch fire. And I screamed at my husband. I just yelled, oh God, save me. And all of a sudden, like the fire just fell and I jumped. With her husband and neighbors helping her up and into the street, her 15-year-old daughter, Jaylee, started screaming, Ollie, Ollie woke me up. She said, yes, that's how I heard the door. She said, because Ollie came to the room. She's like, where's Ollie? So we couldn't find him. The next day, the family searched for their pet bull named Ollie. They checked the burnt house, posted all over social media, even checked local shelters, but nothing until January 9th. And my husband went in and he found him at my daughter's bedside at the foot of her bed and like he had collapsed from the smoke inhalation and uh, I just wanted to give him a big hug you know because if he hadn't gone in there Jaylee would have died. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below and once again thanks for watching KSAT.